The DJI Avada 360 has moved well beyond the rumor stage. Rather than an experimental concept, DJI appears to be preparing a fully realized product that closely mirrors its Osmo 360 camera, re-engineered specifically to function as a drone built for aerial 360-degree capture. With retail packaging leaks, FCC listings, and official-looking promotional images already circulating, the details now feel largely confirmed. Priced between $999 and $1,200 for the Fly More combo, the DJI Avada 360 is shaping up to be one of DJI's most premium and creator-focused drones yet. This is not an Avada 2 replacement. Instead, it represents a bold new direction that blends FPV flight with true 360-degree imaging and advanced safety technology. At the center of the drone is a dual-lens 360-degree camera system, reportedly using large 1 over 1.1 inch sensors. That is unusually large for a drone and allows high-resolution spherical video and ultra-detailed panoramic photos. Image quality is expected to be closer to DJI's Osmo cameras than to typical action camera setups. To keep true FPV control intact, DJI reportedly uses a physical rotating gimbal. The camera can mechanically switch between full 360 capture and a forward-facing FPV mode. This avoids heavy digital cropping and allows pilots to fly once, then choose angles later without losing real-time responsiveness. Safety also sees a major leap forward. Leaked information points to LiDAR-based omnidirectional obstacle avoidance, creating a constant 360-degree safety bubble. This is especially important for a 360 drone, where framing is not always forward-facing. LiDAR improves awareness without turning the drone into a fully automated system. The DJI Avada 360 is expected to use OcuSync 4.0, with a rumored transmission range of up to 20 kilometers. A 38.67 watt-hour battery, about 22% larger than the Avada 2's, could deliver around 25 minutes of flight time. A redesigned, darker airframe with a rear-shifted battery balance completes the package. If released as expected, the DJI Avada 360 could fundamentally change how FPV content is created. The DJI Osmo Pocket series has played a major role in shaping handheld content creation, and the Osmo Pocket 3 remains widely used by professional creators thanks to its 1-inch sensor, 4K video recording, and advanced AI autofocus tracking. As interest grows around its successor, new leaks are offering the clearest look yet at what appears to be the upcoming DJI Osmo Pocket 4. Recent leaked images suggest DJI is testing two different Pocket 4 prototypes in the wild, photographed alongside the Pocket 3 for comparison. These prototypes appear to represent two distinct variants, likely a standard model and a higher-end Pro version. Both units lack branding or logos, strongly indicating that they are early test models rather than finished retail products. One prototype features the long-rumored dual-lens setup. This version has a noticeably larger and heavier camera head, making it bulkier than the Pocket 3. Its design closely matches earlier leaks shared by trusted sources, reinforcing speculation that DJI is preparing a Pocket 4 Pro aimed at advanced users. The heavier gimbal and enlarged camera module suggest more complex imaging hardware and enhanced stabilization capabilities. The second prototype appears closer to the traditional pocket design, but with meaningful changes. It features a single camera module that looks larger than the Pocket 3's lens, possibly housing an upgraded sensor or image processor. This variant also includes visible physical buttons below the display, pointing toward faster manual control and reduced reliance on touchscreen menus. Interestingly, a previously leaked image from a Barcelona shoot aligns closely with this single-lens version, further supporting its authenticity. Both prototypes show redesigned gimbal systems, highlighting that DJI is experimenting not only with camera hardware, but also with overall balance and ergonomics. As of December 19, 2025, DJI has not made any official announcement regarding the Osmo Pocket 4. However, based on ongoing leaks and testing activity, an official reveal in early 2026 now appears increasingly likely. Alongside this, a compact wireless device has also surfaced. It appears to be designed specifically to work with the Osmo Pocket 4, 
while also supporting other DJI action and 360-degree cameras. This device is not a camera, but a small wireless remote created to work with portable imaging devices such as gimbals and action cameras. Now let's address the real story behind the DJI band confusion and what is actually happening. Over the past few months, social media has exploded with panic, rumors, and misleading headlines about a supposed DJI ban in the United States. Comment sections are filled with people claiming DJI is already banned, that their drones will soon stop working, or that DJI products will be forced offline. The truth is far less dramatic and far more complicated. Here is the most important fact. DJI is not banned in the United States. As of today, you can still buy DJI drones, cameras, gimbals, and microphones, and you can use them exactly as you always have. There have been no shutdowns, no restrictions, no forced deactivations, and no DJI product has suddenly stopped working. The fear revolves around a real deadline built into the National Defense Authorization Act for 2025. According to this law, the U.S. National Security Agency must complete a full security review of DJI by December 23, 2025. The strange part is what happens if the agency does not finish the audit in time. An automatic ban is triggered, not because DJI was proven unsafe and not because it failed the review, but simply because the review was not completed. At this point, no U.S. agency has even started the audit, which is why many analysts and creators are raising concerns. The risk here is procedural. The ban could happen by default, even though there is still a long timeline before anything becomes official. Some lawmakers believe DJI products could pose national security risks, claiming they might transmit sensitive data back to China. However, it is important to note that no public evidence has ever shown DJI drones secretly sending data. In fact, a leaked 2021 Pentagon report found no malicious code in DJI Government Edition drones. Over the years, DJI has added numerous security features, including local data mode, offline operation, AES-256 encrypted links, optional cloud syncing, and enterprise-level data controls. In 2024, the company even stopped automatic log syncing in the United States. DJI has repeatedly stated that it welcomes a transparent audit, as it would help clear up years of speculation and misinformation. DJI's pattern hints at something big, dropping between November 2025 and January 2026. The pricing still under wraps, but insiders say it'll land in the premium zone, likely around $1,400 to $1,600 for the base kit. Performance upgrades are just as thrilling. Early reports suggest up to 30 minutes of flight time, a huge boost over the previous model's 23 minutes, and stabilization. DJI might finally break its FPV tradition with a mechanical gimbal paired with enhanced Rocksteady and Horizon Steady systems. That means even during wild FPV dives or rapid twists, your footage stays buttery smooth, like it was shot on rails. Safety's getting smarter too. The Avada is expected to feature 360-degree obstacle avoidance. For new pilots, that's peace of mind. For pros, it's creative freedom to fly bolder, closer, and faster. With AI-assisted flight modes, an upgraded DJI RC Motion 3 controller, and the sleek new DJI Goggles 3, this drone isn't just about flying. It's about feeling every moment in the sky. If these leaks hold true, the DJI Avada isn't just another FPV drone. It's the one that will make every pilot, creator, and filmmaker fall in love with flight all over again.